Yeah, hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to everything. So before I get started, I want to say something really quick. So a couple videos ago, I uploaded an insane aquarium video of the No Guppy Challenge. I finished Adventure Mode, and I wanted to do something different, so I made a montage, kind of, and I put music over it. Now, it did get copyright claimed, but here's the twist. Not for any of the songs or music I used, because it tells you in the in the thing, if you click more in the description, it tells you what was bad. Between, so, I had my phone playing music right on my computer. It was next to my computer, and then the microphone on the computer was picking up the music from the phone. And there was an advertisement on the phone for some game about monsters that were singing or something. So that played for about one second, and then I muted the phone, and that was all it took, and then bam. So I just thought that was kind of funny. You know, it, I, ran, I got into the Salty Spittoon, and then I slipped on the ice cube. Now, I'm not saying just go around and start using music. But I think this one time, it was worth it to make a cool video. So go, if you haven't already, go check that one out. Now, speaking of doing things different, I got another little twist for you. Now, I've done this a long time ago, but it was with the games on my phone. Now we're going to do it with the games on my computer. This is something I like to call Rapid Fire. So I'm going to go in a quick succession and play a little bit of each game and just keep going. All right, we're going to do Insane Aquarium first. Also, with Bandicam, I can jump between games because with my regular screen recording, if you exit out of the game and go to your home screen, the recording stops. But with Bandicam, it'll stay on. All right, let's go time trial. Oh. Let's go time trial. It's been a while since we've done this. And then, uh... So the deal with time trial is you have to make as much money as possible. That's it. So get rid- who's texting me? Go away. So basically, we gotta get rich quick. Like Bezos. And on that note, how are all of you guys doing today? You guys having a good day? Hope you guys are having a good day today. There's nothing better than a great day, you know? Because it's so great. Well, that was, that was redundant. Alright, so I'm going to try to get through the beginning as quickly as possible because I need these fish to be able to poop stars. Wouldn't that hurt though? They're all pointy, like coming out. It would just be... Ugh. Oh God. I don't even want to think about that. Eventually I'm going to turn Presto into a second mermaid so they can poop even more stars later. Oh, we got good old Gus, the fat guy. Let me do a little upgrading. No, 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 no. Down here. Down here. Oh, God. Oh, I should have used gumbo. Should have used gumbo. No, no, no. Oh, God. Okay. That was a close one. It was this close. Okay. So when they get hungry again, I'm going to feed them the star potion and then start buying the blue guys. Circle of life. Oop. Give me that gold. Come on, any second now. Any second now. There we go. Uh, 
Okay, so now they're pooping stars. Now I can buy blue guys. Oop, we got a bomb. You gotta be careful with those bombs, because they blow up the fish. But if you're if you're careful, it's a better version of Nico. Kind of. Alright, go get it, get it, get it, get it. You know what? I'm going gumbo. There we go. And, as promised, a second mermaid. So this weather, it was hot, and now it's like, now I gotta wear a hoodie. Like summer. You didn't even say bye, you just packed your stuff and left. What, what, what's with that? What did I do wrong to you, Summer? How, how can we make this relationship work? Uh, buy, buy a few more blue dudes. Now the trick is to try to keep the, the chemical fish. You gotta keep them towards the top of the tank. <coughs> because if they're at the bottom of the tank, then they're gonna poop a star and it's gonna disappear. And then with the mermaids, they'll poop more stars and it's just... It's a cycle of stars and diamonds. That's all it is. There we go. Really? There was two perfectly good stars and you let them go to waste. And the fat guy's back. Alright, everybody brace yourselves. Brace for impact! Ah, uh, we lost a blue dude. It's okay, just replace him. Alright, we're back to full... family, I guess. Alright, so far so good. We got over... over half of ten grand. Which I think is good. I'm actually not sure what my high score is. It'll tell us when we finish. Ooh, good, I needed that pearl. Alright, we're about to break ten grand. If you don't eat the star, I'm gonna grab it. Yep, there we go. We have hit the top. Try to salvage some of those lost stars. You know this is the weirdest ecosystem I've ever seen, but it makes me money, so I'm really not gonna question it at all. All right, here he comes. Flawless victory. Zero deaths. That is what I'm talking about. That right there. You know what sounds good right now? You know what would sound really good right now? Arizona. Because, well, really any southern state would do. It's sunny all the time. And it snows like once every four years. That would be cool, but of course... It's more expensive, so, you know. Guess I'm going to freeze. Alright, three minutes left. I think we can... We can at least get to 25 grand. We can at least do that. We can get to a quarter of a hundred. Alright, I have a feeling the, the fat guy is going to come back. Ah, oh, you missed a star. Alright, everybody get in position. Oh, that's a bad place for you to be. 
Nope, nobody died. Nobody died. Like I said, not going to question it. Okay, you guys, I went through all this trouble. I brought two mermaids into this tank. And you're just letting the stars go to waste. I could buy more blue dudes. But they're probably going to die if I buy any more. The whole world just revolves around you, doesn't it? You're going to eat when you want to eat, huh? When I was growing up, my mama, I ate whatever she put on my plate. And if I didn't, I got beat. Kids today. See, look, told you, we get 25 grand. I have a feeling I've done better in the past, though. I just got that feeling. Can we get 30? Can we push 30? Oh, no, 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 up here, up here. Oh, God. There's food in the tank. He's going to go after it. Up here. No, 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 no. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, that was entirely my fault. I got Spazzy McGee with the feed button. Well, I don't think third is going to happen anymore. Or will it? Whoops, not mean to click the star, but I did. Okay, they're not going to get that. No, they're not going to get that. Come on, we can do 30. Every, everybody keep pooping. Oh, we're so close. Well, what do you know? I did it. You see that? You put your mind to it, you can do anything. Ooh, nice little thing here before the time runs out. Oh my god, that's a new score. Alright, well, done with this game. Now we're going on to Zuma. Not Zuma's Revenge. Zuma. The first one. If it loads... Now, I believe this came out about a year and a half after Insane Aquarium. Could be wrong, but I think. Alright. You know what this feels like? I feel like that stupid guy in the horror movie where they bury an ancient temple or artifact or something. And then I dug it up and I opened it up. I completed this game on the channel ages ago. And now I've reopened the ancient temple. I have unleashed the demons. I've unleashed the balls. Well, I did it once. Do it again. There we go. Gotta love that old school Aztec music they got going on. Now, unfortunately, this is before the revenge part. So there's no lightning or cannonballs, but it'll do. It'll do, Donkey. Oh god, not this music. That music is bad. You don't want to hear that. Because once it gets inside your head, it doesn't lose. Extra life. I would have liked an explosion here. I don't know 
what that was. Sometimes I spontaneously bust into, into rhythm. Okay, we're on the moon now. Interesting. I don't know if you can hear it, but if you listen closely, there's even a heartbeat that goes on as well. It's here! It's the beating of the old man's hideous heart! Oh god. Now this is where most people would panic. But I got this. Don't worry, I'm gonna dig us out of the hole here. Specifically that hole, his mouth hole. Whoops. So, like I've said before, regardless of which version you're playing, the trick to Zuma is you just keep going. Keep making matches, keep making shots. You keep fighting. So you know that it's objectively impossible. The last thing you want to do is wait for that perfect shot and waste time. Because in, in Zuma, if you waste time him and on, you're gonna die. So you always gotta be... It's like in gym class. If you stop moving, you die. Well, that didn't happen in my gym class, but in this one it does. Gotta be faster than the person next to you. And you don't have to be fast either, you just have to be consistent. It needs to be a nice flow of matches being made. Now it's funny because usually PopCap games, they have a reputation for being easy. But this one, unless you've played it for years and years, it'll, it'll get you. Oh god, I'm, cl I'm clenching a little bit. That barely did anything. The worst explosion ever. Okay, one more, and then the next game. You gotta love how the frog winks when you beat a whole stage. This one just gives me a headache to look at. It's like, it's like an egg. Okay, I might make an omelet later. Maybe some scrambled eggs, sunny side up eggs, fried eggs, egg burger. If you, you gotta put a fried egg on a burger sometime, it's really good. Even some ketchup on it too and some cheese. Best, one of the best meals ever. And also, another tip with Zuma, you gotta master that quick double shot. Like this, for getting coins. 
that double click is gonna save me. The power of the double click is one that cannot be ignored. Back, you savages. You're not going to scare me with your creepy music. I got this. Good, that, that was neat. Most of the time, when the power-ups come, you don't really need them. And then when you need them, they don't come. But every once in a while, you get that one moment where you get the perfect backwards ball or explosion. Next up, we're gonna do. What's we wanna do? Hmm. PVZ. Today. Do 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 when PopCap released this game, it, it just exploded everywhere. Hmm. I want to do a mini game because they're pretty quick. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Uh, this one. We're going bobsled bonanza. The winter is coming. Here, let's go with all of their weaknesses. We got starfruit, cactail, spikes, jalapeno. You need jalapeno. Could you do bobsled bonanza without jalapeno? That would make a video for later. All right, so get get this stuff. We'll need sun. Hmm. One one slot left. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Uh. This one. We're on a tight schedule here. You know what I realized for the most part? I for some reason, half of the plants that you get in the game are either super happy or super angry. There's no in between. Like sunflower, happy. Squash, pissed off. Jalapeno, enraged. Cattail, adorable, and then starfruit. It's like he doesn't even know what's going on. He's just... Yay! I guess the, the more work a plant has to do, the angrier it'll be. I guess it's determined. Like, it's like, I'm gonna fight for my... my, my, my. Wait, what is it? I was about to say freedom, but they're plants. They don't move. He's gonna fight for my brains. That, that's what we're fighting for. Oh, I should have brought potato mine, but oh well. Well, what's done is done, right? That was stupid. Come on, a little closer. <laughs> Goodbye. Let's go play. This, of all the tracks, the pool one really gets stuck in my head the most. 
Especially when the bells start coming. gonna start having some fun. to wake up earlier than that if you want my brains. You know what's funny? We, we, we say that we have brains, but there's only one. It's, but we, we use it like portal for some reason. Like, if you've ever heard the, 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 if you've ever heard the expression, you got no brains, even though it's just one doesn't make any sense. I guess we're all zombies. This top row is gonna be perma, perma shutdown. I might just leave one lane open to make it a fair fight. Because once you get these silver ones, it's pretty much over for the Zambonis. It's pathetic, man. And also, I wanna get some star fruit here as well. You know what? I got an idea. You go away. Now here's the thing. Like I said, I could have just absolutely obliterated them, but I want to give them a fighting chance. Maybe a couple more star fruit and a spike or two. Maybe one more cat tail. Come on, you can make it. Go crush the star. Or maybe. You can. Loser! You're a loser! Are you feeling sorry for yourself? Advancing, they're, they're still dying, but they're advancing pretty far. So I feel like we got a fair fight going on. This is like... I feel like I'm playing with my little brother. And I gotta hold back, because I don't want to beat him badly. Oh, 
We haven't used this guy yet. You can go right there. See, yeah, like I said before, I hope you guys are having a great day. You know what? Let's expand upon that. I hope the whole week was good. Well, I know it's Monday, so we just started, but the week before that. So I hope it was that was a good week for you. Now, I've heard rumors. I don't know if it's true or not. It could have been faked. But as you know... They recently added the catapult zombie to the sequel, Plants vs. Zombies. You know, the basketball guy, he flings and he throws him. Well, apparently, they're also thinking about adding the Zomboni and the Bob's letters to PBZ2. I don't know how they get access to it, but there's a channel on YouTube where they look at the code of future updates for the game. And there's assets for Zamboni. So this could happen in PvZ2. And if it does, unfortunately, they buff the Bob's letters. Where even if the ice ends, the Bob's sled doesn't stop. It's gotta be taken out with plant power. So I think where the zombies have the most chance right now is the bottom row. That's the weakest. Come on, guys, you can do it. Well, no, you can't, because I have a, I have a fail save. But I'm gonna at least pretend like you can do something. Yay! Congratulations! You win a prize. Death again. Came so far just to fail. I really should have gotten at least one straight shooter, like a pea shooter or something. rock up there is about to bite the dust. I think other than having to replant here and there, I think we I pretty much Okay, zombies, it was funny up till a point, and that now it's just sad. Come on. You know what they should have done if they wanted to make the Zamboni more deadly? If you notice, it actually gets slower as it gets further to the left. They should have just made it go fast all the time. That would have been it would have been detrimental. I think there's a mod out there somewhere where that's one of the changes they make to it. Where it's always the starting speed. Yeah, they can't do anything. And even if they could, we have one. story for you. So it was... What's today? Today is Monday. Oh, by the way, Happy Lee Ferrickson Day! ding a ding a -derg. Now, I'm either gonna upload this... Um... I think I'm gonna upload this either the 9th or the 10th. So this may not come out on Lee Ferrickson Day, but just in case, I thought I'd say... Ooh, diamond! Yep, I got maxed out. I want a capitalism. Oh, 
Okay, can someone at least try to kill me? You know what? Here, I'll give you. Sorry, I got I got distracted. So anyway, it was Saturday, so a couple days ago. And just like usual, I was doing the dishes, and we have uh, music that plays in the store. So it plays over the speakers, and Thriller comes on. And I decide to play a joke on my coworkers. As you know, at the end of Thriller, there's that laugh. And when that laugh came on, I went all in. I started laughing like a maniac. And these two female co-workers are like, Matt, we got some sage in our car. I mean, my grandma's a priest if you want that. And I'm like, oh no, Thriller was playing and I was making a joke. I think, I think that they think that I was possessed. Because they started talking to me about like herbs and stuff, like stuff that helps with demons. I'm like, what am I doing? Hopefully they forget about that. But probably not. Oh my god, he's actually doing it? Oh, you did. <laughs> nice try, buddy. Nice try. Okay. Here's the thing. I know that I already finale this game. But I think we can give it one last revival. And go to Chuzzle. Now, I'm only going to play one level because I want to not spend too much time. I missed you guys. I missed all you fluffy fluff balls. Bang, bang, bang. Bang, 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 bang. I can bang all day long, baby. Wait, what? Um, never mind. Oh, I guess. Oh, God, where is it? I'm not joking around. I oh. That was not a joke. I actually already lost it. Okay, can we just keep... Can we just keep the momentum going? Can we do that? There we go. See, that's what I'm talking about. Nice and fluent. There we go. You know, are we murdering them? Or is this what they want? You know how, like, some tree seeds, they can only grow in a forest fire? Like, high temperatures make the seeds crack? Is this how chuzzles reproduce, or are we killing them? Or... You know what? You know what? One more. I'll play one more. That was too quick. Okay, one more, and then we're moving on. Instantly got rid of the fat one. Wow, okay, that was... I did that by accident. Okay, this is, this is the best I've ever done so far, Chuzzle. Okay, I don't believe it. Knock on wood. But I'm actually on a roll. Somehow I'm actually doing it. Look, Ma, I'm doing it. Are you proud of me? Okay, now.
All right, where is it? Wait, it's here. I'm looking for Baldy. It's here somewhere. Oh, here it is. Now, the reason he's in the files is because there's a story that has to do with being, like, trapped in the game or something. So that's why it's in there. All right, guys. It's time to go back to school. Your favorite. Warning. It's scary. All right. Welcome to Baldi Basics in Education and Learning. That's, That's me. me! Okay, so we're not going to do anything special. We're just going to play the regular game. We're just going to have a regular good old Baldi time. Oh, better get ready. Hey, I'm at your own house. Oh, Baldy, I've missed you. Now it's time for everybody's great job. Great job. Great job. Great job. Right. Great job. Great job. Hey, I got Here, something to say. Great job. Shiny quarter. Just click on it with the interact button to pick. Problem one. Oh, I can't believe it. I. Here we go. It's true colors. You know what? It's nice to just play the regular game for once. You don't gotta worry about a teleporter. You don't gotta get all the questions wrong. You don't have to get all the notebooks twice. Oh, maybe I've said too much there. Hey, it's Arts and Crafters, and there he goes. I hear playtime. She's lurking. I realize this is going to be a bit of a longer video than usual. But I hope you enjoy it. And you can always put it to... I think YouTube lets you speed it up. I would recommend 1.5 speed. For this particular video. There he is. The fact that Baldi is allowed to be in a school where there's children really shows how broken our system is. Negative four, three, eh. I'm not gonna answer it. I plead the fifth. All right, going around the bend. Check for the principal. Be aware. Oh, no, you don't, playtime. No, you don't. Let's no, let's not play. I do not want to play. One. That's 13, right? Yeah, it is. Hmm. I got it. Go on the internet and see a lot of these. Alright, no principal. Let's run. Still no principal and keep running. Now usually when he gets to five notebooks, he gets pretty fast. So we gotta think fast. You just keep moving. He'll never catch you. Well, that's a lie. He will catch you. Come on. Just to the end of the hall. Hey, Baldy. Come here. No, 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 no. No. You dirty Rude. Dirty robot. Now I gotta waste another beast soda. Oh. You lot. You bums. Slozenoids. 
I was sabotaged. I, see. I almost ran. I almost ran. Bye, Principal. Oops, he's still there. Okay. Somehow, we lived. I lived. I don't know how, but I lived. I don't think Baldy knows where I am. Oh, nope, he's there. Okay, I got the boots, so I don't get swept. <laughs> oh no! Oh. You're not gonna get me, arts and crafters. You're not gonna get me. Oh, I looked at you for point two. Ah, oh, you. Let me at, le at least let me get this exit. I don't know where I am. I'm dead. So dead. So dead. Goodbye. Welcome to Baldi Basics in Education and Learning. That's me. You suck. Thanks for playing. Come back soon. I will not do that. Okay, now let's go to the other Zuma. Zuma's the revenge. And cue the lightning. Passing time while game loads. Squaring circles. Just like that, an island is born. Alright, let's go back to one of these challenges. And we're going to try to ace this one. Check this one off the list. We got to get... Over 90,000 points, it's probably going to be 105,000 or something. It's all about points. Points this and points that. What is this, an arcade? We in 1982? Want to play some Pac-Man? Waka Waka? Oh, uh, here we go. Oh, I missed it. So close, and yet still close. Okay, I don't know why, but I have a good feeling about this one. This one in particular feels good. We're a long way away, though. Alright, time to get serious. Okay, we're almost, we're almost at 50,000, but we're running out of time though, so we gotta, see the tricky part is, if you make chains, i.e. multiple mat, oh, like that, I messed up, multiple matches without not destroying anything, you get like a, you get more points, but most of the time these glowy balls are singles, so you have to break the chain in order to get it, it's like, it's like pick your poison, basically. Uh, 
purple. Purple is the way to go. All right, time to make chains while well, we got the multiplier. Ooh, yes. That is good. That is great. Keep the colors coming. Okay, we got 90,000. We got to keep pushing. We got to keep pushing. Don't stop for anything. I broke the chain, but that's okay. Like I said, just keep going. Just keep pushing. Come on. Yes! We got the ace. I did it. I have completed my quest. I have done well. Okay, one more game, and that is Seven Wonders. Now the thing is, I'm thinking about ending the Seven Wonders videos because I've actually been practicing off camera, and I always get to 7-3 or 7-4, and then I just get stuck. I don't know how it happens. All right. Now this is kind of long, so I'm only going to play one level. Yes, I know how to play. Don't you just love that? When the game itself insults you? It's like, hey, you suck. So here's how to do basic stuff. Breathe to stay alive. That's very important. Hmm. I've got an idea. I know a door is going to come. And I can use this fireball. So I'm going to save the fireball. My beard is itching yet again. I swear, I've said this before, and I'll say it again. Every time the seasons change, everything goes wrong. My tire light comes on because of the pressure. My allergies start acting up, now my beard's itching. And there's money missing out of my bank account. Not really, I just made that up. But it's a possibility we gotta be careful with. Alright, gotta give them their saltine crackers. They love saltine crackers. I know they're supposed to be bricks, but they look like salt. Like, look, look! They're crackers. They're saltines. Now, speaking of saltines, has anyone ever tried dipping them in mayonnaise? I know that sounds gross, but you gotta give it a chance. It is so good. It is so delicious. Oh no, I'm losing it. Oh wait, here it is. Just don't lose your cool. Gotta stay a cool dude. I know the door's coming soon, that's why I got this fireball ready. It's gonna be in it for a real big surprise. Hmm. Alright, good, get one of these top ones out. I really want oh, here we go. Really want to save this fireball. Come on, Edor. I know you're coming. I know you're coming. Oh, I'm out of Pepsi. I got a spare. Rule number one. Always have a spare Pepsi. Always. This video is not sponsored. I just really like soda. I'm going to die. Oh, thank you. Game's insulting me again. 
Okay, is this door gonna show up or what? Because I know the second I use that fireball, it's gonna show up. So I'm just waiting. Hello, lady. It's taunting me. Okay, good. This whole top row is gone, which is very good. And also, the game does not autosave. So if you quit in the middle of a level, you'll restart that whole level. Oh, it's out of range. Okay, I guess I'll just use this now. Oh, oh. Goodbye. If that's not an interesting turn of events, I don't know what is. Okay, we, we might actually win something. Well, we're not gonna get a prize, but we'll beat the level. And this corner is gonna be a real... Oh. Never mind. Oh, wait. Did you just drop down? Oh, really? We needed this going. I was gonna say it. Jimmy! He said Jimmy! Jimmy! Ooh, fireball. Mm. Go there. Okay, Post Malone, Sunflower. I need you to destroy it. You stupid son of a. So, by the way. Uh, I don't know. I was gonna say something, but I forgot. Once again, that is out of range. Every time. Every single time. It gets down to one brick. One thing. Man, I thought I was gonna win. You are scum. You are the lowest scum in history. No wonder all these wonders got destroyed. Nope, we, we lost. No, the, the soda's gone. Well... That's just the way the cookie crumbles, I guess. Okay, well, that's about all the games for today. Now, pretty soon, I'm going to be starting a new game, so look forward to that. But for now, I must take my final bow. So, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Happy Lee Ferrickson Day, Hinga Dinga Durgan. And everybody, do me a favor. Have a fantastical day.